Muntingia, Wikipedia article audio. Muntingia is a genus of plants in the family Muntingiaceae, comprising only one species, Muntingia colabora. It is native to the Neotropics, from Mexico south to Bolivia. Description Distribution and habitat Ecology Vernacular names Uses Cultivation Muntingia colabora is a shrub or tree up to 12 m tall with spreading branches. The leaves are alternate, disticus, oblong, or lanceolate, 415 cm long and 16 cm wide, with toothed margin and covered in short hairs. The flowers are small, solitary, or in inflorescences of two to three flowers, with five lanceolate sepals, hairy, five obovate white petals, many stamens with yellow anthers and a smooth ovoid ovary. Fruit, an edible berry, red at maturity, about 1.5 cm wide. M. colabora is native to southern Mexico, the Caribbean, Central America, and western South America south to Bolivia and Argentina. It is present in tropical climate in disturbed lowland areas from sea level to 1000 m of elevation. This species colonize disturbed habitats in tropical lowland areas, becoming part of the secondary vegetation, as well as gallery forests. It thrives in poor soil, able to tolerate acidic and alkaline conditions and drought, but doesn't grow on saline conditions. The seeds are dispersed by birds and fruit bats. Although native to tropical America, M. colabora has been introduced in Southeast Asia and naturalized there and in other tropical parts of the world. Common names include English, Caliber Tree, Capelin, Jamaica Cherry, Panama Berry, Strawberry Tree, Ornamental Cherry, Jam Fruit Tree, Singapore Cherry, West Indian Cherry. Spanish Cereza, Memiso, Nigua, Bolena, Capelin Blanco, Chitato, Pasito, Yumanaza, Cerezo Caspi. Tagalog, Eratiles, Datiles, Riddles, Latiers. French, Boiremier, Cerisea de Panama. Tamil, Sarkare Palamaram. Canada, Gazagas Hananamara. Iloco, Sarasa, Zanitas. Swedish, Panamabar. Thai, Takhop Ferang. Vietnamese, Trngca. Portuguese, Calbera, Pau de Seda, Calabora, Curumi, Pau de Seda. M. colabora is planted as a source of timber and fuel. It's soft wood used for rural construction, while the bark is fibrous and used for making ropes. The fruits are edible and in some cases sold in markets, as can be eaten raw or processed as jam, leaves can be used for making tea. There are also traditional medicinal uses reported for the leaves, bark, flowers, and fruits. It is planted as an ornamental species, and also because the flowers are a source of nectar and pollen for the beekeeping industry. The tree is also planted along river banks in Brazil, as fallen fruits attract fish. M. colabora has a potential as a useful species for restoration of disturbed areas and stop soil erosion. It also offers shelter for wildlife as it is a source of food for CA60 species of birds and mammals. M. colabora can be propagated from seed, seedlings, or cuttings. In Costa Rica, seeds set in the wet season, but require conditions of light and temperature found in forest gaps.
in a test where seeds were placed in wet paper towel, at 25 degrees Celsius a total of 44% of seeds germinated in white light, while none germinated in dark conditions. <laughs>